up guys, it's Justin Hobson. Give you a little rundown on Jordan Smith's Firepower Honda. All right, starting here at the front of the bike, Jordan runs neck and bars. Do not run a spacer. He's a pretty low guy, so he, his bars are uh, kind of made for him. We actually run a works connection clutch perch. Stock front brake, pretty much, pretty close in. So he's not he's not a very particular guy. He likes it a little touchy. He loves, likes them run pretty even, even with, uh, even with him. We uh, run his uh, heel switch as far to the right as we can. Just uh, if something happens, he doesn't hit it. Tend to push that to the right as far as we can. Jordan runs the uh, ODI grips. Uh, he runs the, the soft ones. He likes that soft feel for his hand. Throttle tube, it's a billet throttle tube. tube it's is a little more durable for uh, in case you crash. You know, it, it doesn't break that plastic. He runs his polar mount so he can keep up with his heart rate. We actually run uh, three, three mil is what we run. We actually, Factory Connection has really helped us out this year a, a lot. Ziggy, uh, Mike Hayes, Guam, they've, they've really been on top of things this year for us. So. Run the neck and triple clamps, works connection, pull shot device. He is at 180, 180 mil down. He's pretty deep. Straps are, whenever you have that much pressure on the, on the forks and that fork guard and that whole shot device, it's gonna wanna rip out. So the, the metal actually gives it a little more strength to, uh, so it won't rip out. Easy E hubs. Yeah, we run the Pirelli. We just switched to uh, the 32 uh, mid soft. We actually, run the, the mid soft on the on the rear as well. We we've been running the uh, the Stadium, which is a, a kind of like a Pirelli spec tire. Jordan decided this week that he wanted to try the 32 mid soft again, the production tire, the one you can buy. Uh, tried it this week, and uh, that's what that's what we're going with. We've tried the oversized, and he wanted to go back. We actually run the we run the brake and brake pads. As far as the the caliper and the the rotor, he's, he he has switched back to uh, stock. You break a spoke, keeps it in line, keeps it from getting bound up in, in the axle, so that way you can possibly finish the rest of the race. Pin, we drill a hole through it, so uh, in case something happens, you hit it, it doesn't open up and doesn't come loose. Radiators were braced by a, uh, a guy that we have in Tallahassee. He's braced those because uh, the Hondas are a little flimsy, so we gotta put a little more uh, backing on that. He's very good at tearing stuff up. We gotta give him a little help. Renegade Fuel this year. He's ran this, this seat all year long. He likes it pretty broke in, so we're on the uh, SKDA seat cover. SKDA graphics. Moving on down, we got a little uh, HGS exhaust system this year. They're kind of new to the Supercross world, doing a little development and technology for them this year, so it's uh, working pretty good. security say you get in a first turn pile up or uh, you crash on the track and you blow your start button off on the on the handlebars you have a secondary switch that you can uh, get started and keep going twisted development built us uh, engine this year Jamie Ellis over at twisted is doing a great job uh, we run Henson internal components on the clutch uh, Jordan does run a, a stiffer spring he uh, he prefers that that pop fairly likes the bottom end. He likes he likes a lot of bottom. Jamie's provided us with a good combo this year, so uh, Jordan really likes the, this engine. We're running Wozner pistons. We got uh, actually works chassis lab with the motor mounts. Jordan preferred the uh, extra stiff this time. He likes it a little a little rigid. Everything stock other than the pegs itself. We run the Raptor foot pegs. You can get those at WPS. Everything on the the back end here is uh, for stock. Jordan brake pedal, uh, master cylinder, super light titanium bolts, pretty much on the whole entire bike. There's a couple bolts that we don't put in. Jordan felt like it was a little too much, so we, we stuck with stock. The braking rear uh, rotor. Running with the uh, DID rims, we do run oversized spokes uh, just to give them a little more beefy. Factory connection. Jordan likes his stuff a uh, little, little stiff. Guys over at Mike Haste at uh, Factory Connection has really done a good job with us this year. Jordan runs 1350 for right now. It can change, it can vary uh, going track to track. Subframe is stock. Behind here, which you can't see, is a twin air filter. We have a uh, actually have the twin air power flow kit. Fire power batteries. Coming more up, up towards this side, you, it's very noticeable for, for a lot of people. We do run a second injector on this motorcycle, which Jamie Ellis has developed for, uh, for us. We also run the electric water pump. Might give you a, give you a couple more horsepower. There's less components inside to, to make stuff go, so you take that stuff out. Gives you a little more or less drag on the engine. Got a Honda, go over and see Jamie. He'll uh, he'll hook you up. Front to back, we're we're Psycho Plastics. 
Like I said, SKDA graphics all around the motorcycle. Skid plate is actually stock, and we uh, run the stock disc guard up front as well. A custom uh, carbon fiber transponder bracket, which uh, transponder is keeps up with uh, timing and scoring on, on the track. Between motos, we run uh, Froth, which is a, a new cleaning company that has come on board this year. You can find it in your stores in a couple of weeks. Marty rides, he's been riding a lot more now, so he does a, a, a lot of testing for us. We, we get a good, good a lot of feedback from, from Marty, and Marty can get the bike set up pretty close to, to what Jordan and Jarrett really likes. So yeah, it just takes a lot of time where the guys can actually ride their motorcycle, like train. We, we just have, a, we got a new shop uh, at MTF now. We're a, a privateer team, don't have a lot of crew members. So there's, it's a lot of work that goes on, but we, we get it done. We're looking to, to go a little bigger next year, working hard.